click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Now again we are solving a problem based on drawing a network. So you need to solve at least 8 to 10 problems or minimum 12 to 15 problems to get some confidence regarding how to draw the network diagram. This whole chapter is based on the network diagram. In fact my diagram goes wrong then all my calculations will go wrong. Therefore it is very vital that you focus on drawing the network diagram. Keep on practicing in the rough. Use a lot of pencil while drawing the diagrams at the initial stage. You are bound to commit the errors. You are bound to commit the mistakes. But see to it that you are perfect in drawing the diagram. Once you get the hold on drawing a network diagram, then the next part starts regarding the calculations. So let's see this third sum now for network diagram. So here A is the initial activity because there is no other activity before A. It is preceding it is dash. For B the preceding it is A that means B can start only after completion of A. Or I can say in other words B will come after A. C will come after B. Even E will come after B. And D will come after C. Then we have F which will come after E. Then we need to join D and F. From where we will start with G. From E there will be H. From H there will be I. I need to again join G and I. And then I will get J. And after J I will get K. Now this is a bit complicated problem with too many uh, relations or connections we need to draw and be extremely careful while drawing the diagram if you are drawing directly with a pencil with a pen always better to solve it with a pencil in the rough and then proceed further first i will draw my network diagram initial activity that is activity a So after A, I have got B. So after A, we have got activity B. And then after B, we have got two activities here. Be careful now. After B, we have C. After B, we have E. So I'll draw C and E simultaneously. After completion of B, so here it is my C and here it is my C, and then we have E, it starts after completion of B. So we are done with A, we are done with B, we are done with C and E. C ke baad hamare paas activity D hai. Aur mujhe D aur F combine karna hai. Aur E ke baad F aur H bhi hai. E ke baad F aur H hai. C ke baad we have activity T. After E we have F. After E we have F and I need to combine D and F. After V I also have H. So I have E ke baad F B hai, E ke baad H B hai. E ke baad main F ko upar leta hon because I need to join D and F. So here is the F and here comes my H. So we are done with F, G and H. F, G starts after completion of D and F. 
सो डी आर एफ मेरा ज्वाइंट हुआ वहां से निकलेगा मेरा देन आई नीड टू ड्रॉ एच के बाद आई एंड आई नीड टू ज्वाइन जी एन आई सो एच के बाद मेरा आई में ऊपर लेता हूं ये मेरा आई ये जी और आई मैंने कंबाइन किया वहां से निकलेगा मेरा At last, I have the final activity that is K, which comes after before J. My last activity after J will be. You need to check the diagram again. Always, it is beneficial to check the diagram for the connections. A is the initial, A K bar B, B K bar C, B K bar E. A is the initial, A K bar B, B K bar C, B K bar E. Then C K bar D, C K bar D, E K bar F, or E K bar H. E K bar H, E K bar F. D और F कंबाइन किया वहां से निकला कौन सा कंबाइन D और F वहां से निकलेगा G ये रहा D और F कंबाइन वहां से निकला G एंड देन आई हैव I H E और F कंबाइन हो वहां से निकलेगा E के बाद निकलेगा H E के बाद निकला H And then finally we connected G and I. वहाँ से J निकला, J से निकला हमारा K. Now numbering the diagram, I will always prefer to draw the numbers from left to right. So left में सबसे पहले one, फिर two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. एंड सो वी आर विद द नेट डायग्राम थैंक्स थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग दिस वीडियो डू सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल इक्विडा